Shout out to Jafezi JD, who asked me to check out the Audible Instruments modules. This one's called the Resonator. It's a physical modeling module that resonates incoming audio, giving it a different body and tone characteristic. It can simulate resonance in lots of different materials, and therefore can make some killer sounds like this. The main inputs and outputs are here. The outputs give you audio, and can be plugged right into your mixer. This module takes three main inputs. A trigger, which initiates the note. A volt per octave to control the pitch. And an audio signal that plays through the resonator. Providing just one of these inputs still makes a noise, but having more or fewer will alter the sound, and I'd like to encourage you to experiment with how many inputs you use. This little button controls the polyphony. We have one, two, and four note polyphony available. This allows us to play more than one resonated tone at a time, without snipping off the amplitudes. But once you pass the selected polyphony, the notes will start to cut. All these knobs work in about the same way for every resonator type. The frequency knob will adjust the pitch in semitone increments and spans about five octaves. The harmonic structure knob controls the frequency ratios for each resonator mode. The brightness knob controls the amount of harmonics in the signal and has a big effect on the sound of the simulated material. Low values to the left simulate hollow, dark materials like wood. And high values to the right simulate materials like glass or metal. The damping control changes the decay time of the resonated tone from about 100 milliseconds at the minimum to 10 seconds at the max. The position knob controls where the strike occurs on the simulated material. You can get different harmonics based on where you hit things. Like on a string, you could hit it at the end. Or in the middle. Or a quarter of the way through. And all of those will have different resonating characteristics. This button allows you to cycle through the three main resonator types. The first is called modal. Here's a more woody sound. And here's something very metallic. The frequencies that go into the input are essentially filtered through the simulated object. In this example, I'm sending a sawtooth wave in, and we're also sending in a gate. Here's just the saw wave by itself. And here it is now being sent through the resonator. This next mode is called Sympathetic Strings, and it simulates the sound from a set of strings that isn't directly hit or plucked. It's like if you open up your grandma's standing piano and you shout into it. The strings resonate the pitches from your voice. And the same thing happens here. Here's me shouting into the resonator in Sympathetic String mode. And here's that same sawtooth wave again. Last, we have the string resonator, and it simulates the propagation of a wave over a string hit at different points. Here's a burst of sound going into it. And here's that sawtooth wave again. That seems like all of it, because this button only cycles three times, but there's more in the context menu. We have a classic FM synth voice that sounds like this. A 
set of quantized sympathetic strings, and they sound like this. You can change the chord quality with the structure knob. And then we have reverb string mode, which is of course a string resonator with reverb applied. We also have the disastrous peace toggle here. This is a great chord generator. The structure knob will alter the chord quality again. And now this button controls three different effects and the position knob controls the effect amount. We have a filter, chorus, and reverb. This thing slaps in an ambient drum and bass vibe because it has that parallel chord change quality, especially with a bit of reverb on it. This is a killer module for making all sorts of sounds and it's free, link in the description. If you like this kind of stuff, you can let me know that by liking, subscribing, and leaving a comment. Just a reminder that all of the content I make will always be free for everyone, and you can find it on my Kofi page. Huge shout out to Tom, who's the newest supporter added to the list. Thank you so much for your generous support. You rock, dude. Shout out to all my Kofi supporters. Y'all are certified awesome. Okay, that's all. Bye.